Jatai Academy, J-A-T-A-I.net on the web. And welcome to another video in our ongoing educational series. Today's video is on proper use of your barber chair. If you take a look along the row here, we've got a beautiful matching set of five painter chairs from 1965. They're classic barber chairs. Uh, square shape with a hand pump on the side. It's a wonderful chair to cut hair in. I've used them here in this shop and other shops for many years. Several people along the way in my career have been influential in sharing with me proper use of a barber chair. Proper use of a barber chair will help you be a better hair cutter. It'll help you provide better customer service and it'll actually add years to your long-term health, wellness, and durability behind a chair. Let's cover the basics. Basic number one, in our industry we talk about standing behind the chair and very often, especially folks that have a cosmetology education, spend a lot of time working like this. I've never worked like this. Never with the client facing the mirror and never with me standing behind the chair. If you take a look at the floor, you'll notice our floor mats. Cameraman will pan down and see. Our floor mats are on the back side of the chair. Our floor mats are not on the front side of the chair. And that's not an accident. When working behind the chair in a traditional and classic barbershop environment, and that's exactly what this is, my mirror is on the wall, my styling station and my sink is here, my chair is placed in front of the sink. Ideally, I want to cut hair standing here. I want to cut hair standing with my right hip to the counter, my plugs are on the wall, my clipper is in my hand, my cord runs over to the outlet. I don't have any of this game wrapping the client up in the cord and running circles around the chair. So one of the most important elements of chair use is turn the chair. The hair cutter remains stationary. I stand here all day. I am facing forward. I can see the door, the cash register, the TV, the window, the clients in the waiting room. I stand here and I cut hair. I have a mirror on this wall and a mirror on that wall. And I use those two mirrors to check and assess my work as I go. The fact that the chair turns is fundamental to good haircut. Next on the list after turning the chair is the issue of pumping up the chair. The chair goes up and down, raise and lower the chair. If you're working over the top of the head, drop the chair, lower the client so you can maintain straight up posture, comfortable shoulders, and reasonable hand positioning. But if you're tapering through the perimeter or a neckline, let's pump up the chair. Let's get that client higher up so we can see where we're working at a comfortable height and at a comfortable level. When there's no one in the chair, the chair should be down, forward, and locked. Lock the chair so it will not spin. When an old man walks up to the chair and puts his hand on the armrest for stability, if the chair's not locked, and the chair spins, that little old man's going down on the floor and you've got yourself a lawsuit. Down low so the client can comfortably enter the chair and locked for stability when a client puts weight on the chair. These are very heavy chairs. You and I together couldn't lift this and we don't want it to move. We want it rock solid and we want it stable. Last on the list of how to properly use your chair, clean the chair. When you sweep, sweep off the footrest. When you invite a client to the chair, make sure you've blown any hair off the chair. You and I stop caring about hair clippings. Clients just don't feel that way. Your chair is a powerful hair cutting tool. It is as important as your mirror, good lighting, a light colored shirt as a cutting backdrop, and your floor mat as a form of protection under your feet. I'm Ivan Zoot for Jatai Academy. Let's take a look at our specials for the month coming up for March and April. These are all good through uh, April 30th. We've got the Spring Style Show in San Jose, California. That is April 14-15. We've got $3 off on the Jatai Teasing Pin Comb and 15% off Feather Switchblade Shears and Blades good through the end of April. J-A-T-A-I.net. On the web is our home. You know where to find us. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.